Sociopath behavior. Help. Questions for U.S. states, part 37. Next up, Oregon. What's a commune? I don't know. I don't live in Oregon. putting chemicals in the water that turn the freaking frogs gay. Do you understand that? Turn the freaking frogs gay. Serious crap gay. Frogs freaking frogs. It's not funny. I'm going to say it real slow for you. Gay frogs. Okay, let's rate these. The world is gonna roll me. Okay, that's a 10 out of 10. Okay, I like that one. 10 out of 10. Fucking get a life, you fat fuck! Jermaine. Oh, you had a heart attack. Hey, he getting up through on him. Wow. Or... <laughs> Oh, no, I gotta get the dude running away. I gotta get him. Where he go? Where he go, man? He got up through. He is not go. Bro! Oh my god! Shawty wanna fuck. Shawty likes it rough and she's got a big oily butt. A big round wet McMuffin Shawty's got sexual techniques And a big round oily butt Goosebumps on a booty cheeks I wanna bust the night Random plastic chain? No, it's a 3D printed dinosaur with a flexible body I wish I was a dinosaur because all of them are dead Here's three TikTok songs you need to add to your playlist right now. If they're not in there already, what are you doing with your life? Number one, this ain't build a bit. Oh, oh dear, I almost said a potty word. <laughs> Number two, what you know about rolling? Hey. Number three, hey Julie, how'd you got that drip, 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 drip? Hey. <laughs> Thank you. Who's gonna make her feel safer? The nice guy? Oh, I don't want to hurt the tiger's feelings. And this is why women will continue to screw themselves over in the dating scene. Usually the nice guy is just able to control his emotions a lot more. Whereas the asshole is emotionally immature and just lets everything loose. That nice guy would literally die for you. Just because he doesn't beat the tiger doesn't mean he's gonna not try. However, the asshole that you guys like to go for will most likely just try to save his own skin because he has other women lined up. So ladies, you're screwing yourself over because you want to have your cake and eat it too. But I'm sorry, but that's not how life works. Boys, back me up in the comments and drop a follow if you agree. I just... I just hate my job, bro. And I'm not pursuing my dream. Let me tell you something. I know you.
You can be whatever you want to be. Speak that shit into existence. You're right. My man. I'm going to be in the NBA. <clears throat> this motherfucker is 30 years old. Yeah, I mean... Paulie speaking. Hey, Paulie, what's up? D why is he calling his boss? No, yeah, yeah, no, everything's fine. Hey, listen, I quit. Jesus Christ. Wow. That's the first one. That's the first one. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you God, dirty motherfucker. The way, bro, it gets better because now he's about to, like. <laughs> oh, my God. Third time. <laughs> Second. Oh, shit. He broke away. It's about to be four, Greg. Oh, my God. I'm going to have fucking. Let go of it. Oh, shit. Wait for the last one, bro. <laughs> oh my God. So I had to do the second video. This is the final fourth. This is the fourth time he comes in. The oh shit. <laughs> Okay, we're gonna have Thumper type it in the chat. <laughs> Super insightful words. Thank you, Pikachu. That's very true, Thumper. There are some places you cannot go to in the astral plane. First one is Area 51. All projectors that have tried to go to Area 51, which we would all try, right? All of them have reported there being some sort of astral bubble, which doesn't allow them to go in it. Obviously, this is some form of higher technology, which is multidimensional. And we know this is a high likely chance to be true. One, because all astral projectors report this. And two, the CIA has already declassified documents saying that astral projection is real, so... Number two, you can't go to the moon. Extraterrestrials from across the galaxy use the moon as some sort of base in order to conduct their activities on. A lot of them just either observe or they study or they mine. It's reported that they actually hollowed it out. Apparently they weren't happy when NASA tried to land there and when astral projectors go there, they're thrown off with some sort of arm. It's clear they don't want people snooping their bases and they possibly could have some sort of agreement with the government because they've taken so much precautions to make sure people don't snoop in this thing. The third one is Neptune. For some reason we're told not to go there which is actually kind of stupid because now people are going to want to go there more. When you think about it our whole solar system is actually really strange because we're told not to go to certain planets and certain planets people go to and they see certain things like it's actually really creepy. If you're an astral projector my DMs are gladly open and get ready for part two.